tectonic plates shifting that he wants me to share. But first, let's look at some recent oddities with our moon. In many of these federal aviation weather images, our moon appears as a tiny dot in the sky, such as this footage taken from the weather camera located in Bathurst, New Brunswick, in Canada. All of these images were obtained yesterday from the FAA weather cameras in the U.S. and Canada. We know that this tiny light is either the, either the moon or the projector that displays our moon because the dot we see in these images does coincide with the moonrise chart from timeanddate.com. Timeanddate.com describes the moon rising and traversing the sky at the exact same time as the date and time stamps on each of these images. Additionally, this chart shows the moon traveling west-southwest, which is the direction it's traveling in these FAA pictures. The south-facing camera in Wasilla, Alaska, shows us the same tiny dot moon phenomenon. Only in the first two frames, the moon actually appears normal size before it suddenly shrinks down to a small dot within 10 minutes. Now, common sense should tell us that the moon cannot go from this to this in just 10 minutes. In just a minute, we will see what looks like a projector or a projected moon image in the sky. It's very strange. And it does coincide with the moonrise time charts. The south-facing weather camera in Thompson Pass, Alaska shows us the same large moon passing through the sky which suddenly becomes a tiny dot. The dot becomes infinitesimally small as it approaches the horizon and finally disappears into nothingness. 